Welcome to the Millbrook Railroad, and today we're working on the turntable lead track. We're back to the pit. We're back to the pit. Yeah, we, we have to dig down. We, I gotta get the ballast up from underneath the table itself, but looks like we we'll also have to adjust the ring again over here. But uh, anyway, we've, we've got to put in a wall here. A cement block wall for the lead track to the turntable. So we're going to do that. We're going to use the jankiest piece of track we have, which is uh, you guys saw right over here. Video, it's come out at before, uh, here we are. This right here, the jankiest, rottenest piece of tie we have, or track we have. All the ties are rotten. We'll use that. It's a engine house track. Who cares? So anyway, I guess we got some digging to do. Closer though. This has to be even with this, which actually looks like it is already. So I guess we've got to dig sideways. Do we now. have a loose piece of rail? We do. So we can check these things. Yeah, we can. We have loose sticks of rail right here. See, right here. Hey, look, loose sticks of rail. They're a little bent. That's mm. sad. Oh, oh well. well. Um, the only problem being is there's a pile of dirt in the way. A pile of rocks. That's enough. We have rakes and shovels and implements of destruction. We do. Look, roadbed. Hmm. 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 Perfect. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, actually, yeah, it's got to. So it's got to come up a bit. Well, no, well, cause no because ties. ties and Take the actual oh. piece of track. Yeah. Flatten up this piece of roadbed here. Yeah. There we go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. Okay. That's good. That is actually almost perfect. Hmm. We're pretty spot on. Almost. Just gotta, you know, wedge it down in the ballast and. Mm -hmm. Yeah. We're actually a little high in the ballast. The ballast is high. Well, good. It needs to go down in the ballast. Yeah. So level out the ballast a little more. Or... Dig a hole in the ballast. Dig a or hole. Dig a hole in the ballast. The jitterbug. Dig a hole in the cold, cold ground. We could run the jitterbug over it real quick. Well, we still need to dig a hole in it, bring it down to level, and then put the... Okay, so what I'll do is I'll yeah. do one or two passes. That works. Well, uh, if you call that level, we have to have a talk.
So if you pull that back, I'll put the camera down and try not to step on it. And... I just don't want my hands in the way. Yeah, um, hang on. Let's, uh, you know, this camera is pretty inconvenient sometimes. No, when we don't uh, have a tripod. I mean, why don't, why don't one of you guys hold the camera? Here. Here, here, here uh, you, you take this. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, yeah. There you go. Where are you going with it? You could uh, pull that back just enough to make two apparatus. Make, so, make some space. There we go. Yay, it's food o'clock. It's food o'clock. Okay. Oh no, they were ready for that. All right. That side needs to be lower. Okay. Or me thinks. You're probably right. It also needs to be closer. Well, actually what we need to do is dig this side of the cloth down and drop the cloth into the hole and then we'll do stuff. Is this becoming Excuse an after-dinner project? I think so. We'll get the night lights out. Uh, we'll be back after these messages from our sponsors. Now it's a couple days later and we're working on the turntable again. We've got, still got to adjust this trench a little bit over to the, uh, the left. My left or your left? Yes, left. We're both facing the same way, so yes. Yes. Yeah. Yes, sir. So to, to the left in the picture here, we've got to dig some more roadbed. Um, and let's see, we've got uh, landscaping fabric that's been uh, torn up a bit. I guess uh, I, gotta, I gotta cut that. I think I need to get that a couple inches closer. Got this just about where I want it. It's a rather sharp curve, but I don't think it's avoidable. Avoidable? I don't think it's avoidable. Well, without adding a whole nother bit of ballast and re-leveling thing out here for the track to sit about here. Yeah. Which would require ballast and more than what we have. Yeah.
mean, hey, you can still read it. Huh. Look at that, it's level. That way. That way, that way, and that way. All right, so um, I stood on one end of this, like and like so, the other end over. and, and uh, Eric here squished the other end over, I and mean, it looks like your end more that way th this right? is a much much nicer curve than we had before. Let me let me just move this over a little bit more, about like where, yeah, that's about where the switch will be, like like that, and uh, yeah, that's a nicer curve. I like that. As long as we hug this uh, this side here, I think this we'll be good. This little ballast wall. Yeah. I think uh, we, if we open this up a little more here, yeah, that can be done um, with a shovel, and then then take this piece of track and toss it. Let's take a look at what we got here. We got track. We got track going to the turntable. It lines up. Hold on, I have one. La oh, that wasn't my foot. I have one last thing. Dropping to do. stuff. I didn't do it on purpose. I've got one last thing to do. One last thing to do, he says. Probably going to do the twist on the turntable. Well, anyway. So we've got our turntable, slightly charred, did that a couple of years ago. And let's see, we've got our, uh, got our lead track, it needs to be tamped. Yes. Eric's putting a <laughs> truck on there. There's quite the number of rocks in the way. Yep, there are, and it's small rail, so, so. the rocks are larger than the rail. Yeah. 
Got to come up with a way to um, lock the turntable in. But it works. Yeah, that'll work. And apparently see, it works see, that if you, way. see if you can put it in the center. See if that balances. Or did I really mess up the turntable when I installed it? I might have really messed up the turntable when I installed it. I mean, that could be the ring, too, so... I'm you know. going to go with ring for now. Yeah. Because remember, we removed the ballast out from under that side and jacked up that side. As it derails. Hey, look at that. Sad to say, it's not a Millbrook Railroad radio, though. Hold on, I can fix that. Now it's a Millbrook Railroad radio. It really video. didn't want to come off. We've had a derailment now. <laughs> it didn't want to come off. I almost flipped the whole thing over. <laughs> Sometimes you got to force it, right? I had to. <laughs> All right. Well, I guess that's going to be it for now. We'll re revisit this uh, another time with when we uh, uh, cut a switch in. We've got to do some work on the main line here. As you can see, that uh, horizontal kink. The uh, joint is basically down in the dirt. So I've got to jack that joint up. I've got to basically turn that section of rail into a switch. And uh, yeah, we've got to do things. So this has been, what, near a week for me. Almost a week. But for you guys, it's just going to be uh, however much time. There. For you guys, it's going to be whatever the runtime of this is. Yeah, we're going, we're going on about a week. Yeah, this is a week. Yep, last Saturday. Yep. Is yeah, when last we Saturday started we started this, and here it is. Now here it is Saturday. Next Friday. And uh, we finally got the uh, got the track in, and we've got the, the roadbed made. So yeah, it, it's it's been a week for us, but but for you it'll only be maybe 20, 30 minutes, um, maybe less. We'll see what it ends up being in edit. Ends up and what I, footage ends up where. And, and I'm probably not going to update what I'm saying here in the edit, so it'll just be what it is. Make a comment down below and tell me what, what you think this is going to time out as. Of course, you'll know by then, but I don't know now. So, yeah, future. We won't know until it's posted. Yeah. Until I'm done editing it. So, anyway, with that, that actually looks pretty good. It does. That, the more I look at it, the more I'm proud of this little curve. It's got to curve a little bit more here, but that's yeah. not as bad as it was going to be. Right, so th this is actually pretty good. Well, um, I think we got that other, what the curve was. And I think it's one of the flattest pieces of the railroad, so, you know, it, it's, this is, this is not bad. Not I mean, bad n there's nothing flat on this railroad at all. It, as you can see by Would you agree, Eric? <laughs> is there a flat piece on this railroad? I have yet to find out. Uh, I, I've yet to find it either, and I've been here for a long Since time. It was built. Yes, since Actually, 2009. Just... There's there's not a single flat section on this not railroad. Either goes up or down. Not even the turntables. Yeah, not flat, even the, not see. even the turntables flat. So you know, it's, it's keeping in character with the Millbrook Railroad, built on the side of a mountain. Not that you know it. It's a little bit of a plateau. <laughs> if you did like this video, hit the thumbs up button. Join us over on Patreon, Patreon.com/slash/MillbrookRailroad, and uh, of course. You can also join us over on Discord. You can also become a uh, channel member. Hit the thumbs up. I said thumbs up. The bell notification icon. That thing. Yeah. That works too. The ring ding. And uh, I won't see you in the next video because that would be creepy. I mean, really, think about that. I guess I won't see you in the next video, but you'll see me. And that's um, over here somewhere. Bye.